In a world dominated by technology, a silent and growing menace threatens our environment and health. Electronic waste or e-waste in digitally revolutionized country India has become a big crisis. But good news is that there are environmentally responsible young ones in India who are leading to combat this looming disaster. Meet Ojas Parvatraj Tambade, 7th Standard student from Dadra Nagar Haveli, an environmental activist and gold medalist in Dr. Homi Bhabha Balvadnyanik Science Talent Search Competition 2020-23 with a mission to raise awareness and bring about change in the world of e-waste. E-waste is a type of digging away harming our planet and our communities. My journey starts in the COVID pandemic when I realized the magnitude of this problem. E-waste is the fastest growing waste stream globally with over 50 million metric tons generated annually. And we can tell you for India, this crisis is twofold. Dumping from the West is just one problem. The second is India's own e-waste. A United Nations report says that India is now the third largest producer of electronic waste in the world. And if all this waste is not disposed of properly, it could have major ramifications, not, sh not just for the people, but also for the environment. I surveyed the students of Dadar Nagar Haveli in February 2023 regarding e-waste disposal practices by their families. I also did ethical analysis of my findings. Most of students and their families were not aware of the hazards of improper e-waste disposal and they were selling it to Kabadiwalas. I traced the journey of e-waste of Dadar Nagar Haveli and found that there is no exclusive e-waste collection center here. And astonishingly, municipal corporation do not get any e-waste. I followed Kabadiwala scrap dealers at nearby town at Wapi and its transport to Gujarat, ultimately ending up with unsafe, unauthorized recyclers. So the result of my ethical analysis was an eye-opener. Ojas made an action research project on ethical analysis of e-waste disposal practices in his area of Dadra Nagar Haveli and presented it in third stage of renowned Dr. Homi Bhabha Balvadnyanik Science Talent Search Competition 2020-23 in March. He secured gold medal in this competition. In collaboration between the NGO Wildlife and we and the Science Club, Ojas launched the campaign E-Waste Warrior Challenge, Educate, Collect and Safely Dispose. Fellow students educated their peers about e-waste and its proper disposal. Creating a ripple effect as these students in turn educated their parents and neighbors. The campaign extended its reach through social media discussions, poster making competitions and quizzes centered on e-waste. Sojana, 
public place of life become entertaining and comfortable and becoming a special environment. The impact of the campaign was substantial. It effectively educated over 15,000 individuals about the hazards of e-waste and collected about 277 kg of e-waste, all of which was duly handed over to authorized recyclers Eco Green Nana Pondha, Gujarat, for safe and responsible disposal. Oja's commitment to environmental sustainability did not end there. He presented his findings to the Honorable Collector Dadra Nagar Haveli, advocating for the establishment of authorized e-waste collection centers in Dadra Nagar Haveli. We should use e-waste as a valuable resource, not trash. It contains special metals and materials that can be reused. You should buy any electronic electrical items only if you need them, not just because a new model has come out in the market. If your old equipment is still working, consider giving it to someone in need. If it's broken, get it repaired and put it back to use. Items that are completely unusable should not be sold to scrap dealers. Instead, take them to an authorized recycling center and obtain a receipt. Near our Dadra Nagar Haveli region, Chroma Electronics, a Tata enterprise, collects e-waste from us and ensures proper recycling of it. All, they also plant trees in our name. Ojas Parvatraj Tambade's work serves as an inspiration to all of us. Through his unwavering dedication, he reminds us that change is possible. Look at your surroundings. Right now, you are surrounded by lots of hidden e-waste. So, open your eyes with awareness and recycle everything, how small it may be, from a plug, cable or a charger. Together, we can ensure a sustainable future for generations to come.